Hi, welcome back to GP Reactions. I uh, hope you're having a great weekend and as always thank you for subscribing. So I'm going to be listening to a band now called Golf Rap and um, this is a track taken from um, I think it was their first album which was Felt Mountain uh, so it would have been from about the 2000. Um, now I do kind of remember um, maybe it was around about this time my brother was telling me that he went to see a a kind of rejuvenated uh, Duran Duran concert um, in Birmingham somewhere and and he was kind of raving about the uh, support band uh, and that they were called Golf Rap so I'm kind of really kind of curious to um, he's, he's talked about this album for quite a while um, and if it was like the early days when we uh, when I was like a lot younger I would have probably heard bits of it but um, I do know a few later Gold Frap tracks. Um, I can't think what year that would have been from. Maybe it was the next album down. Um, so I'm kind of really kind of like looking forward to hearing this. So this is uh, Gold Frap with Lovely Head from their 2000 album um, Felt Mountain. I, I kind of I feel like I'm listening to a piece of drama um, it feels like a, it feels so dramatic um, I, I, I'm kind of uh, not not mystified I, I'm enchanted by this this is a uh, this is incredible um, Wow <laughs>
oh my god that was like really strange but amazing um i mean how good her voice sounds it's the whole the whole song kind of felt very lonely but obsessive and yeah lonely and obsessive but i kind of liked it because it, it it's really strange it's like having it's like a, having a drink with somebody like having a coffee with somebody or a drink at a bar and then telling you is is some really dark story about their life and yeah it kind of felt like it that's how it was played out in my head um it's like somebody who's kind of reached a, a point who's who's at an edge um of, of, of making a decision about something um you gonna have to dive into these lyrics i think um it starts in my belly, then up to my heart, into my mouth, and I can't keep it shut. So you kind of there's a gut feeling you know something's wrong, and you can only go for so long without. And all of a sudden, you kind of find yourself just saying, "What the what the heck is going on?" You know, I've I've seen you kind of you know um, going out. You know, you come back. Um, you know what's going on i know something's wrong tell me now um do you recognize the smell is that how you tell us apart so is this is this her imagining that he somehow uh how how the other woman would smell or look and how um he'd tell them part or perhaps he he's kind of messed up he's basically Maybe he's mentioned uh, a perfume that she doesn't use, and that's kind of ringing alarm bells. Um, but you know, people do have their uh, di distinctive kind of perfumes and aromas and smells, and, and there's something about a person that kind of it's it's very non-verbal and it kind of makes up who they are. And um, perhaps, um, and I think if he is having an affair, then perhaps at some point he's going to slip up and get confused. Um, to sleep, I uh, I fool myself to sleep and dream. Nobody's there, nobody, no one but me. So cool. So I kind of imagining. I, I I'm thinking that perhaps she's imagining that the relationship's finished and she's on her own, and and that um, uh, taking the emotion to one side, she could be happier. Uh, you're hardly there. Why can't this be killing you, Frankenstein? would want your mind, your lovely head, Frankenstein. Is that saying that he's some kind of monster or that he's uh, devoid of uh, emotion as kind of Frankenstein would appear to have been? Um, it's just like a really kind of strange, amazing music and um, amazing track. Uh, the music was so strange uh, that that kind of, what was that a vocal, uh, like a vocoder or something that she was that created that sound in between, but it was almost like a scream. Um, yeah, this is a really amazing track. This is a, I, I can't believe that this wasn't a, 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 a single. Maybe it's just a little bit too strange. Um, but this was like year 2000. So I would have thought it would have been kind of a fine track to release as a single. Um, but no, it's, uh, it wasn't released. Um, but it's an amazing track, and um, yeah, I, I mean, I'm thinking what else is on this album, uh, Felt Mountain. Because for some reason I, I feel enchanted by this now, and I want to, I feel drawn in to kind of listen to more. Uh, she's got a very, very interesting voice as well. It's, it's, it's kind of a weird thing about her voice, it's almost like she could sing a, a song from the 60s. And it would sound exactly the same, or the 50s maybe. Anyway, uh, you know, I kind of really enjoyed that uh, first time listening to this. And uh, hope you guys enjoyed it too. Let me know what you think about this song. Um, join me in the comments below. And uh, yeah, until next time, take care of yourselves and have a, have a great weekend.